here a fair coin is tossed four times and a person will win one rupee for each head and he will lose 1.5 rupees for each tail that turns up so and from the sample space calculate how many different amounts of money you can have after four tosses and the probability of having each of these amounts so uh, let me first write down the sample space a fair coin is tossed four times this means that uh, every time I toss a coin I can get a head or a tail so total number of elements in the sample space will be 2 to the power 4 which is 16 so if I write on all the 16 elements it will be all our heads uh, HHTH HHTT similarly if I complete the entire table this will be my total sample space of 16 elements where each uh, letter represents the outcome of the that particular toss of the coin ok so since it is said that the coin is a fair coin so the probability of getting any one of these outcome is simply 1 by 16 because all of them are equally likely and there are 16 outcomes so probability of each one will be 1 by 16 ok so now what am I said uh, a person will win 1 rupee for each head and he will lose 1.5 rupees for each tail that turns up so if I call my income as i i is equal to uh, number of heads uh, into 1 rupee that is what I will gain uh, and for every tail I have to lose money so I will put minus uh, number of tails into 1.5 right so now uh, in this case all four are heads so what will be my income i will be equal to 4 here 3 heads and 1 tail so 3 into 1 minus 1.5 this will be 1.5 right similarly this also will be 1.5 this here I have 2 heads and 2 tails so I will win 2 rupees and I will lose 3 rupees which is same as minus 1 rupees is what I will win so here again it is 1.5 here it is minus 1 here it is minus 1 uh, here it will be I have 1 head and 3 tails this means that uh, I will win 1 rupee and I will lose 4.5 rupees so I can tell that minus 3.5 this will be uh, 1.5 minus 1 minus 1 minus 3.5 uh, minus 1 uh, minus 3.5 minus 3.5 and here there are 4 tails that means 4 into 1.5 that is what I lose so minus 6 so I have calculated the amount different amount of money I can get uh, for all the elements of the sample space so if you can see I can take the values uh, either 4 1.5 minus 1 minus 3.5 or minus 6 right and I also need to find the probability of having each of these amounts so here I know that probability of occurrence of any one of these 16 outcomes is 1 by 16 so probability of getting an income of 4 is simply the number of outcomes in which I am getting out uh, I am getting income as 4 rupees multiplied by 1 by 16 right it is only in one element so this probability of getting 4 rupees is 1 by 16 and for 1.5 there are 4 favorable outcomes so it will be 4 by 16 which is equal to 1 by 4 for minus 1 there are uh, 
six favorable outcomes. So for this probabilities six by sixteen or three by eight. For minus three point five, there are four favorable outcomes. So for this probability will be four by sixteen, which is equal to one by four. And for losing six rupees, there is only one case. So this will be one into one by sixteen, which is one by sixteen. So these are the probabilities of different values of incomes. Okay. So this is my answer.